Hi, Zareen. So um, I'm just going to show you quickly how to uh, bring in your bridge because it it obviously needs to come in narrow so it will go onto your chest regardless you know it needs to fit in between underneath your breast because your wire needs to sit on top of your chest wall for it to be comfortable and for the bra cups to fit so if um, and you got to do this with a band only not cups so make another muslin just a band you can baste it it doesn't matter and Put power net in the back, base the hook and eye closures on, and put channeling on. You can base those and put wires in. And this bridge must fit on your chest wall. So fold it in half just to get a middle. Okay, just fold it in half. And then we're going to slash it on that line. And then just cross it over uh, about a quarter inch. You can do it, well, I think, let's do a quarter now that I'm looking at it. Let's do a quarter inch, okay? And you're bringing it in. So what happens is, you see how the, the wires, the 3 8 inch, will be right here. Like when uh, when the channeling folds over, they'll be right on top of each other here. They'll come up and at a point they will overlap, which is okay. What you wanna not do is stitch across so the wires don't go all the way up. The wires still need to go all the way up and they can overlap. It's okay, it's not gonna affect your um, fit or comfort. So when you're top stitching the channeling, just stop at that point where they overlap and then you can secure at the top and then they'll stay put. But they definitely will overlap right in here. But the bridge would have become narrower to fit against your chest. Okay, I hope this is helpful.